Hey, 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 get, hey, hey. I'm sitting. I'm sitting. I'm sitting. Let, get, let me on you. Don't run away like a vagina. Come here. What is up, guys? Milik here, and today we are back in action playing some Arc Mod, and it's gonna be freaking amazing. If you guys enjoy, make sure to go and click the like button. I do, ah, there's a bug. Ah, get, hey, 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 get out of here. Yeah. Uh, I was saying stuff. Thank you for joining me in the video, and I really appreciate it. Like a bug flip on my mic, like close to my mouth. And I was like, yeah, I don't like this. Uh, this makes me uncomfortable. You're kind of in my personal bubble space area, and uh, this isn't very enjoyable. So I, like, picked him up and then flicked him across the room. So maybe that gives him the idea um, that I don't want him around. I don't know. Uh, anyways, <laughs> so let's. I want to go in here. We're going to come in here. We're going to go to elevators. Uh, I want to make, let's see, I have two tracks. I want to make a medium-sized elevator, I think. I think a medium is what I want. Let's make this guy. If I don't need a medium and I do need a large, I don't think I do, though. Then I might have screwed up because my my concern is the Anklo, once it's filled up with weight, uh, the elevator won't, like, work. Uh, so that's a concern I have. And that, that could even be a thing that happens, like, when... Um, He's not completely filled up. Let me go and grab the rest of this metal right here. Uh, we're going to I, I, get at I, I, stuff. Uh, let's uh, put it right here. Let's see. Boom. Okay, that's good. Let's go come out here. Uh, uh, let's get on the Mr. Anklo here. Uh, obsidian, I should say. Let's come out here. You know what? I need to get rid of these stupid rocks. And the thing is, it's my settings that like causes this to be here. And it's really annoying. Like They can just regrow back, and it like kind of sucks. Um Okay, so we have Pretzel the Quetzel here, uh, which is a fan commented name, by the way. Let's go ahead and get on this guy. Let's get off of this guy. Let's come over here. So I actually... What the heck keeps happening? Dude, there's a bug with one of my mods. Every time I log and relog, this thing turns from an industrial smelter. I've replaced this twice from an industrial smelter or whatever the heck the vanilla version is called uh, to a industrial forge, which is a modded item. Um, which really sucks, which really sucks. It looks like we're going to have to do some industrial forges up in here and then maybe stick the industrial smelter at the base or something. I don't know. I mean, these guys are really, really good anyways, but I like to have that big tall thing on here just because that's what I made this for was the new freaking item. Um, let's go ahead. I'm going to, I'm going to kill these guys. Let's kill this guy. Uh, let's kill this guy. Holy balls of glory. Um, holy crap. Okay. Oh, it has to be... It cannot be placed on a platform. No. No. That's not what I want to hear. Wait a sec. Wait a sec. Uh, I guess. Let's just do... Let's do this. I hate that. Did, did that go? Yeah, that went right. Okay. Uh, let's go ahead and stick this guy right here. Okay, let's hop down here. Uh, there should be plenty of room, but let's just go ahead and do, let's see, seven. Let's see. Let's let's do like, are, are, are you, can I place on a platform? Why can't I like snap this? So can you not stick an elevator? Did I just like screw everything up? Can you not stick an elevator like off the side of a thing? Or does it have to like start from the ground? Yeah, it looks like the, the elevator doesn't work. You have to start from the ground and go up or something i'm not 100 percent sure uh this structure can only be placed on a platform dang it okay i was really really hoping this would work um looks like it doesn't work that really stinks that really 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 stinks okay we're back so change of strategy i've placed down some vaults i made some more vaults i actually have an extra vault and an extra furnace or i thought i did did i place down all five yeah, I placed down all five. So we have four vaults. We have four furnaces. They're all kind of like opposite from each other. I think it's pretty fine. We have uh, lots of room up here. I decided to use the electric furnaces because I've never really used them to smelt iron before. And I'm not sure if they're good or not. So we're about to find out. Uh, I like this better than the actual uh, forge because the forge runs off spark powder even though it's really, really fast. Um... And we want something that's easy to kind of like keep charged and works really well and that kind of stuff. So I have a electric generator here. Let's just go ahead. We're going to stick this guy like, I guess, just like right here. It doesn't really matter where it goes. Uh, we'll just 
boom, there we go, done. Uh, electric generator, uh, let us stick uh, the gasoline in it. Let's turn it on. Um, and then I think that's good, right? Like, I don't know if these are, oh yeah, these are unpowered for sure. Okay, so we're gonna actually have to bring the power to it. Okay, so I have some of the electric cable. Let's go ahead and get on this guy, yeah. Uh, and then I guess, I'm not exactly sure where we want to stick this guy. I went ahead and stuck a duct right here, and we have a duct right there, so that should be good. Uh, let's go ahead, we want to stick this, I guess, it doesn't really matter, to be honest. Uh, we'll stick this, like, right there, boom! Okay, so it's powered, awesome, and it's, like, kind of down in the ground, which is perfect, because we want to be able to see it, uh, but we don't want it to be, like, in the way, kind of, even though you don't really, like, walk in it or whatever. We still don't want it to be in the way. Uh, so I figured maybe, like, right here is probably a perfect place to actually stick an electric outlet. Let's go ahead and do, let's do this right there. Uh, then all these should be powered. Let's see, activate furnace, activate furnace, activate furnace. Yeah, every single one of these guys are powered. Uh, this should be powered as well. Yeah, ducted air, powered, nice. Uh, we should have plenty of this to last a long time. Now, the last thing we really want to do is maybe a bed, and then... I think that's it, really. I think this is plenty of storage for everything. Uh, then we want to be able to foot, uh, fit maybe both the ink lows. And also, I was thinking we could go pick up our saber tooth and stick them on here as well. And then we can kind of like maybe carry it back. I guess that's not really necessary. Uh, but we can stick anything we want to up here. I was actually also thinking we could probably do a um, another little platform up here, maybe. I'm, I don't know. Maybe like a little like castle part. You know how you do like the castle on ships? Maybe like a little castle for like a bedroom up here or something. I don't know. Uh, we could really do anything that we wanted to. Um, also, yeah, I guess we should probably maybe test this and like what the speed is of this. Uh, did I throw away? I or I didn't throw it away. I, I put all my metal over here. So let's grab some metal real quick. I think I put all my metal over here anyways. Yeah, okay. So here's some metal. Uh, I'm going to stick some of this stuff back. Oh, also, I gave myself another furnace, considering this is a glitch. And I'm not really sure where we should stick the furnace. I mean, we could stick it, like, right here in the center, maybe. Like, we could just stick it, like, right here, right? Like, just... Oh, my God, this thing is big. Uh, uh... <laughs> this thing... This thing is massive. Holy crap, this thing is freaking massive. Oh, my God, this thing is huge! Look at this! Oh, and we still have plenty of room back behind here. Nice. Okay, perfect. Uh, then we probably want to do an elevator somewhere. Maybe like an elevator like right here, right in front of the furnace. We'll just have the furnace like directly in the middle. Yeah, that might be really cool actually. Yeah. Okay, cool. So we have the furnace back, which is good. It probably belongs on a base anyway. Um, it would have been really awesome on here, but like I said, the mod freaking like causes it to do weird stuff. Uh, let's stick some of the metal in here and... I guess, does it just slowly uh, do its thing? Like, do I need to, like, tell it to do stuff? Metal. Oh, do, wait. Coke. Okay, so I'm making Coke. Uh, I grabbed that out right there. I mean, I guess it's not that bad, actually. Let's go ahead and stick this right here, and then it's just going to slowly start making metal. Oh, wow. Is this going to be slow as balls? Oh, my God. This is slow. So these furnaces are definitely not something that you want to use, I guess. They're really, really slow. Uh, we'll think of some other stuff. Uh, I, oh, man, I really wanted to use this. Uh, yeah, we'll think of some other stuff, and maybe we'll do that later. But I've actually installed a new mod called, I think, Arc Enhanced. And it adds alphas of a bunch of different creatures, including a alpha argent that's called a phoenix. And I kind of want to see if we could find it today. Or maybe just any other alpha, because you can actually tame them, which is really awesome. Uh, so I guess we're going to, uh, I'm going to go around and start hunting for stuff. And then we're going to try to tame that guy. I think it would be pretty sweet. Okay, so I've actually played with this a little bit more. I wasn't satisfied with the results. So we made three industrial forges. Uh, these guys run off spark powder, as you guys probably know if you watch my series. Uh, and then we made an industrial grinder. So this guy actually makes mass stuff. So uh, we can make spark powder like 10 at a time. All we need is stone and flint, obviously. And then with our anklo up here, we're going to be able to get that pretty easily. Uh, now, I guess the only problem with this now is we need to find a way to actually get the anklo up here pretty easily. And once we do that, it should work perfectly. Now, the elevator could work. I could just be a derp and like not be doing it right. I'm not 100% sure. Um, so that could be a thing. And I hope Hopefully it is. I would really like to have an elevator on here or maybe something else. Maybe we'll have to make like loading stations like everywhere we go or just try to figure out weird ways to get the Anklo up here. 
Uh, but yeah, that's pretty much it. That's all I want to do for this guy. Now, we could make it like multiple floors and that kind of stuff. Uh, but I don't really see the point. Like, I think this is perfect. We have air conditioning. Uh, we have storage. We have ways to smelt. I mean, the only other thing we could really do is just like make this a full-fledged base by giving like a fabricator and a smithy and stuff, which, I mean, we could do. That could be possibly a thing. Um, we could easily do that. Now, I'll probably end up using this guy a lot more than I use like my Bronto or my Mosasaurus just because uh, getting around by flying is way better than I don't really find myself needing to go underwater that often. Uh, and if I do, it's usually get like oil and stuff, and I don't really need like a big base for that. Um, but anyways, yeah, we're gonna go. We're gonna look for some stuff. Hopefully, you find it, and I'll be back. <laughs> look at this, guys. This is crazy. I'm like up in the air. Now watch this. I brought my pterodon too because I thought it'd be cool uh, if we park the quets like super high up in the air and then like get off of it. Then we can get on the pterodon just like that. Then you know, kind of like do our our uh, I don't know a little pre-flight like planning. We just leave them up here, and then uh, whenever we need to come back, we just kind of like land on them, and you know that's good. There, there we go. We're back on them, you know? Like, uh, now the thing is, is, I still haven't, like, figured out a way to get back on them. Actually, you know what we could do? I didn't really think about this. Uh, it's going to be ugly, though. Hmm. I was thinking, I mean, we could just kill one of the floors, right? That would probably work. Um, hmm. How would we do that, though? I, I really don't want to do this mid-air, but I guess I'm going to I'm gonna do it anyways. We're going to do it mid-air anyways. Let's, uh... Oh. Yeah, that works. Uh, we have a big, gaping, ugly hole. You know what I might do? I might put... Oh, that, that killed the corner, too. That was that was a horrible idea. That was an absolutely horrible idea. Why would you guys let me do that? I could do, like, a ladder. Actually, that might be cool. Do, like, two holes and with a ladder? Then I can kind of, like, climb down the ladder and get on him? I don't know. <laughs> I, don't, I don't know. Okay, so I found a alpha... Uh, Dodicarus. Uh, this guy is level 150. I think this is the highest level that we have seen. Or I think this is the highest level that can actually spawn in our world. Uh, now, it's hard to tell if they're alphas or not. But, I mean, well, of course, he has Shimmer, so he is an alpha. But he looks almost the same as a normal Dodicarus. Uh, and the cool thing is, too, is we can actually take our quets and come pick this guy up. But I thought what we do is let's tame this guy. Um, now, let's see. I have 30 CC darts, so we can probably get this guy pretty fast. I have no idea what the alphas are like in this, uh, so we're going to set you to passive. Uh, we're going to shoot you, uh, and you're going to try to attack me, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. You're going to try to attack me, I think. Oh, wow. He's fast. Oh, wow. You're fast. You're fast. You're fast. You're fast. Get away from me. Oh, my God. You're fast. Uh, okay. Oh, no, 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 no. Okay, run away. Run away. Run away. Run away. Run away. What, what do you, oh, okay, let's run back downhill. We're just going to do a giant circle, guys. We're just going to do a giant circle. And you're down. Yeah. Uh, so let's look at you. What's your stats? 11,000. Oh, my God. Look at your weight. Look at your weight. Holy crap, your your uh, your stats are ridiculous. You only have 7,000 torpor, 500% melee damage, 240% movement speed, 7,500 weight, 8,000 food, 660 oxygen. Oh, my God, and 12,000 health. Dude, you're awesome. I really want an Anklo now. Uh, now, the, the does look cool. I, I, I wonder what the Anklos, if the Anklos look really cool. As you guys know, Anklos are like my favorite ever. Uh, and then I saw some pictures of the Phoenix, which is the Alpha Argent. Uh, it's transparent, and it looks like a ball of energy. And when it dies, it makes an egg that can... When it dies, it's just like a phoenix. It's reborn, but it's it reborn into like an, uh, a baby stage of its life, which is really, really cool. This mod is awesome. I think it's really, really cool. Um... So we've tamed him a little bit. Wow, this is actually going to take a little bit, isn't it? Uh, let's uh, remote use this. Yeah, this is going to take a little bit. Holy crap. Uh, but you're about to get 74 levels, 100% taming efficiency. So you're going to be over 200, uh, which is freaking awesome. This guy is sick. I really want to, like, kill, like, rolling here. Hey, come here. Come here, dude. We need you up here. Yeah, yeah, we need you up here. Passive. Um... Yeah, so I guess what I'm going to do is I'm going to pause it. Uh, this guy looks freaking amazing. I'm going to pause it. 
uh, we'll be back. Uh, we will play with him a little bit. I th oh, dang, I need to make a saddle, don't I? I wasn't sure what I was going to find, so yeah, we need to make a saddle. Uh, so I guess I'm going to maybe fly back while this guy is taming. I'd hate to leave him alone. Or maybe we'll wait till he tames and I'll go get a saddle and come back. I don't know, but I'm going to pause it and I will be right back. Okay, guys, so he's about to tame. It's really, really close. Come on, dude. You're so close. I w yes! Yes, we have tamed a Dodigris. Oh, my God. Look at his stats at level 223. We lost about two or maybe. No, we only lost one level. I think it was like 98 uh, percent efficiency or something. I don't know. Uh, I actually stopped using narcotics on him because he was taming faster than we needed narcotics. So it wasn't really that big of a deal. Um... And looks like he's eating to get his food all the way back up. Holy crap. Uh, so he has 17,000 health, 900% melee damage. He holds 8,400 weight, and he has 365% movement speed. He has the same movement speed as their days of the year. Uh, so I went back and got a Dodicarus saddle. Let's go. Oh, so a normal Dodicarus saddle works. Oh, my God. Is he bigger than a normal Dodicarus? I think he is. Um, he's definitely bigger because I think I, yeah, yeah. Let's look at this guy. Maybe. Yeah. He's definitely bigger. I think so. And he looks so cool. His colors are so nice. We need name suggestions for this guy. Also, I think this is going to replace bark. Uh, or I mean, I guess we could keep bark here too, but I think the alphas for this, where they're like all tangible and like all like really cool and useful. I think this is really cool. Oh, yes. What's his stat? He has like 5,000 stamina, so he's going to be able to roll for a while. Oh, nice. And he's fast, too. Oh, he rolls uphill. Yes. Uh, I guess we need to, like, kill some stuff. Um, also, what I would like to do, you know what we could do? Uh, we can kill stuff, but I kind of want to see how well he mines as well. Uh, I haven't really done that much mining with Dodicaruses. I'm not sure. Do they get metal and stuff? Let's go ahead and get on Pretzel here. Uh, let's fly, and then let's... Oh, okay, so I can pick him up, which is awesome. I mean, it makes sense that I could pick him up. Um, so, good thing we found something. What? Why are you flying so weird, dude? You're like, oh, did uh, is there something screwed up on Pretzel right now? <laughs> He's flying. Oh, lag spike. Uh, maybe the Pterodon is, like, parked in a weird spot or something? I don't know. He's, like, flying and then stopping. I'm, uh, I'm sure you guys see this. Holy crap. <laughs> it's so weird uh i think we're we're probably pretty safe up here so we can kind of park right oh maybe because i was looking up really high i don't know uh okay so let's get off of this guy let's drop down here in our new little found hole uh let's get on the dodicarus and then let's mine oh does he not mine what no or maybe they only mine very specific things because i saw Something to where they only mine specific things. He doesn't mine. That's garbage. That's freaking garbage that he doesn't mine. Let's see. He swings so fast too. Holy crap. Uh, but he could be cool, like a cool little battle mount or something. I don't know. It kind of sucks he doesn't mine. Maybe it's like a weird mod in incom uh, compatibility or something. Um, I guess let's find something to like attack and you know, mess with, and then we'll see how much damage he does. Well, we know we know where Pretzel is. You know what we could do? This would probably be much easier uh, if I just got on Pretzel and then carried him down the hill and then found something that way instead of, like, leaving Pretzel here, leaving, and going off somewhere else, and then... There we go. Yeah, this is this is going to be much easier. Okay, so as long as I don't look straight up, we're, we should be good. Um, also, I never thought about this, but I'm actually perfectly positioned... Uh, next to the air conditioners that if I want to go into the place or uh, the snow area over there Then it actually wouldn't hurt me the air conditioners uh, would keep my thing pretty good So this might be a good thing to actually take over there, which I mean we need to go over there anyways just because of crystal, but Okay, th there we go there. Uh, okay. Um, I, I landed in a weird spot here uh, Let's see No, we want you to stop following me. We want to get on top of you uh, and then these saber tooths, I don't know where they freaking went, but we're going to try to fight these guys or something else. Uh, let's go fight something before we end the video and just see, like, exactly how strong he is. I think that would be awesome. Wait, are you...
Oh wait, Sabertooth right here. Saber hey, what's up guys? You you want some of this? You want some of this? Some of my alpha dough? I don't think you do, buddy. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh, oh dude, this guy is epic. This guy is epic. Oh, he leveled up too. Nice. Get out of here. Oh, he leveled up. Uh, how much? Let's see. Let's do how much movement speed do you get? Oh, you get like 10%. Holy crap, we can make you fast. Holy crap, we can make you fast. We can probably also get a lot of experience too. Guaranteed we can take on one of those uh like things from Bark, those bosses that give like 10,000 experience per. Oh, there's a red drop over there. Um here, let's uh let's go check out that red drop before we end the episode here. Oh, this is epic. Oh, that's so good. This so this is like gonna be my new main mount, I think, possibly. Uh oh yes, I got him. I got him nice. Uh red drop. Let's go over here. Okay, so we made it over to the red drop. Let's go ahead and land right here. We've dropped the dough, which is good. Uh let's come down. Are you up here? Are you seriously up here? No, okay, we're good. No, we're good. We're good. Uh, let's see. What do you have, buddy? Uh, you have an Ascendant Rex. Oh, no. But we have the armor now, though. We have the armor now, though. So it's better than this. No, no. This is better. But the armor's so cool. No. Dang it. Ascendant Rocket Launcher. Hey. 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 Fight him! Fight him! Where's my Dodicarus? Alpha Dodicarus, where did you go? Hey, 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 get, hey, hey! Obsidian! 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 Get, let me on you! Don't run away! Like a vagina! Come here! No, you st Oh, yeah, yeah, you want some of this now? No, you don't want none of this. Dead. Uh, well, I'm going to go and call it here, guys. If you guys enjoyed the video, make sure to go and click the like button. I'd really appreciate it. It helped me out tremendously. And I'll see you guys in the next one. Dude, here, we're going to have you follow me. Uh, no, 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 tear it on, tear it on, no, tear it on, tear it on, tear it on, tear it on. Yeah, yeah, you're going to take off my freaking ankle. No, not my tear it on. Oh, oh my God, I saved. I saved him. I saved you. Uh, okay, well, I'll see you guys in the next one. Get out of here, you stupid creature. Yeah.